what's up guys it's katie aka fancy foodie welcome back to my youtube channel it is day 21 out of 31 i can't even believe that it's been that many days already it's all a blur to me honestly <laughs> but today we're doing a really exciting character it's one i've never done in the past five years i've never painted a character from this show so we're doing smurfette but not just any smurfette you guys know you should know already and if you're new then you're learning today that i can't do anything normal it has to be spooky and creepy especially for october but it's also year-round kind of so yeah <laughs> but yeah i'm really excited about this one so before we jump into it please give this video a like please subscribe and turn on your notifications because we have videos all month long for 31 days of Flutie ween and you really don't want to miss any of them yeah so let's just jump into it wow a video where i don't start with eyebrows amazing right <laughs> so we're taking this special effects cream makeup from nyx this was actually really creamy and good so just slapping that all over my face just blending it like it's foundation we're just gonna be blue we're keeping the blue theme going you know and i did my whole body and my arms and you can guess that i was stained after <laughs> So we're using the Ben Nye cream paint to act as kind of like a highlight, just to keep her a little snatched and, you know, just give it some more depth. You don't just want to be fully just one solid color. So now we got to powder it, powder everything. This is so sticky and once you powder it, it's good to go, but, and it was taking a while, so I just dumped it, you know? Just dump it, just dump it all over you, who cares? <laughs> so now we're taking the Blue Moon palette. This is such a good palette if you want. So dark blues, light blues, everything. It's just, I use this for like everything. So we're just kind of like contouring and everything like we're doing our normal makeup, but it's just all blue. All right, just adding some blue to the lid. And then I wanted to sketch out where the zombie mouth was gonna be before I did any more blue. And I'm just using an eyeliner to kind of like draw it out. And just a blue paint to fill in her lips because I didn't really have like a good blue lipstick. And then adding some more of that Ben Nye just to kind of give it like a little pop of highlight on the lips. And now we're adding the teeth. You know, my favorite part is making it spooky. So now we're taking some red and we're just gonna fill everything in where we drew it out and just make it zombified. Now we're taking the Uh Huh Honey palette from ColourPop. I wanted the teeth to be a little more gross. I feel like yellow teeth looks really good on blue skin too. It kind of worked out. Now the main squeeze palette, another one from ColourPop. I just needed like a darker red shade to kind of shade the wounds a little bit. Now I wanted to add some wounds to the body as well. I didn't want it to just be kind of boring and plain down there. And then I decided the face didn't have enough, so just added some more. <laughs> now we're shading under the clothes using that blue again. We just need to shade it with the darker blue to add some shadows to everything. And now I'm using the cream paint again and just kind of cutting the crease on this a little bit. She's glam on that side and zombified on the other side. Now just adding a white highlight around the wounds just to make it pop a little more. And highlighting it a little bit in the wounds. It just felt a little flat to me, so I wanted to add some highlights. Doing the brows, she is like kind of glam. And then adding the Eldora lashes, my favorite if you don't know by now. <laughs> And then I got to shade the outfit a little bit with some gray and then add some blood dripping because I still wanted to add more. I just felt like it wasn't gross enough. And then I splattered more and then just started splattering more and more. <laughs> it felt too plain to me, you know? I just really wanted it to be gross. There you guys go. What do you think? I added some contacts. I did her classic little hat that I made out of like a shirt that I stuffed with stuffing. And yeah, there you go, zombie smurfette. 
I really hope you guys like it. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do you like me trying new things? Do you want me to keep doing characters that I've done in the past? Let me know. And if you did like it, please give this video a like. Please subscribe and turn on your notifications. We're almost to a thousand subscribers and I really appreciate all you guys that have subscribed already and comment all the time. And the next few videos coming up are super cool. So you definitely don't want to miss out on that. I'm going to be doing some giveaways at the end of the month as well, just to give back to you guys for being so supportive and awesome. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye.